A Milwaukee church hit again and again by thieves. They're not stealing the small stuff. They're walking away with heating and cooling systems from the church roof. Fox 6's Ashley Sears joins us live. Ash, you've got some surveillance here that church leaders, they want us to see. Yeah, Ben, this is now the fourth time in five years that the units have been damaged. Thieves have stolen a total of seven. It's not the units the thieves want, but what's inside? Church leaders are used to elevating people inside Sweet Communion Baptist Church, but lately they've been spending a lot of time on top of it. If you see the, the copper right back here, that's what they break into them for. Just last week, Deacon Lawrence Thomas discovered someone had visited the church at 35th and Vienna for all the wrong reasons. First thought was, I hope I'm just imagining things. He saw pieces of the heating and cooling system hanging from the roof. When he looked at the surveillance from last Wednesday morning, he learned why. So that's actually the vehicle there. Cameras captured a gold van pulling up and people hopping out. And it's a, a man and a woman. You're taking the tools out. You don't see their faces after the camera is turned, but you watch their shadows pass by as they walk across the roof, stealing from five HVAC units. It is a blow when you think of what you're trying to do to help in the community. It isn't the first time they were lifted. Months ago, two units were damaged. The problem started five years ago, and they were dropped from insurance. They're looking at more than $200,000 in repairs. At that amount of money, when you don't have insurance for it, it's pretty devastating. Church leaders now want to close this chapter for good. That is important for us to see justice in, in this case. Milwaukee police tell us they are investigating. If you know anything about the thefts, contact them. If you'd like to help out the church, head over to this story on fox6now.com. Reporting live in Milwaukee, Ashley Sears, Fox 6 News. Ash, I got to ask, is the church open? Do they have heat right now? Yeah, they're still doing their Sunday services, operating off of three units that they've gotten to work. It usually takes a total of 10 to heat the building. So frustrating. Ashley, see us reporting downtown for us.